So remember, I named these tutorial, which really doesn't make sense for what those things are. They're flowers, and I know that. So what I'm going to do is rename them all at once. Now that's one of the cool things about the Adobe Bridge, is that you can rename all your files in all sorts of ways all at once. And so I'm going to highlight these. You can highlight them by clicking and dragging, or you can hold down Shift after you click one and go down. I'm going to make sure I get all the files selected. Then I'm going to go up to Tools, and I'm going to do Batch Rename. Control Shift R will get me there quicker. Now, when it comes in here, I'm going to give it some options. Okay, right now the file name is Tutorial, Date, and Number. I'm going to change it to where it says a new file name. Now, I'm going to give the first one a text, and here it is Yellow Lily. You just type that in. Now, here it also is telling me a sequence number. And what it's going to do here is start at uh, a certain number. I can tell it to start at 1. I can tell it how many digits it's going to be. We'll say 3 digits. And you can see how the current file name differs from the new file name. So the new file name says it's going to get rid of the date and have 001. What if I like the date? No problem. All I have to do is add an item. And these items can be ordered. So I'm going to move that up. And this other thing here, this second row, I'm going to tell it the date. And I'm going to tell it the date created, month, day, and year. And then I'm going to add another one because these numbers are kind of all jumbled up. I'm going to add another one just to do an underscore. I like to have no spaces in my name. I think it's a good idea to have no spaces in names. So now it says Yellow Lily. 619 2013 number one and you can actually see what it's going to look like all at once you hit preview it'll show you what the file names end up getting switched to and I'm going to click OK and then I'm going to tell it to rename voila all my files renamed to what they are